was interested to read that Pauline says when she isn't writing, which isn't often, uh, she can be found walking the coastal paths on the Isle of Wight and around Langston, Portsmouth and Chichester Harbour, looking for a good spot to put a body. <laughs> you wouldn't kind of say that that public, would you, if you were out walking? <laughs> but again, you know, you've chosen a very different landscape, but it's a landscape that you know because it's one you've grown up in. Yes, um, yes, coming from the area and having lived in the area for a long time, I do know it very well, warts and all, um, we know. But it's, it's quite interesting, you know, listening to Matt and Stephen because um, one of the things that Stephen said about the contrast um, bet between the Peak District and um, the cities, I particularly like the contrast um, that we have here between uh, Portsmouth inner city and then the Solent, the beautiful Solent, which is, you know, our landscape. It's vast and it's so vibrant and it's one of the busiest ports uh, in the world. Um, and the contrast between Portsmouth and the Isle of Wight. So I like that inner city contrast with the countryside and with the sea. Um, so I, 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 you know, I, I found, you know, resonate with what Stephen was saying there. Um, and I was just thinking when Matt was talking about um, having never been to America and you said, set your books in America. And um, I was just thinking, yeah, I, I, Google Maps is very useful, isn't it? Very good for an author. Because when I haven't been anywhere, I mean, one of the advantages is, of course, that, uh, like Stephen, I, I, I live on the patch and I can walk the streets and I can research very easily without getting on an aeroplane. Um, I can get on the ferry, the Isle of Wight ferry, of course, but I can research the locations and there is so much around here that gives me inspiration. I mean, there are uh, so many bays and harbours um, and coasts and history again, like you were saying. I mean, the history goes back a long way. Um, so there's a lot to draw.